Hi, this is Rian from Must Be Noob. This lab guide is on how to configure default user permissions in Microsoft Entra ID using Entra Admin Center. In Microsoft Entra ID, all users are granted a set of default permissions. A user's access consists of a type of user, their role assignments, and their ownership of individual objects. It is possible to add restrictions to users' default permissions. The default permissions can be changed only in user settings in Microsoft Entra ID. Sign in to the Microsoft Entra Admin Center. You must be a global admin to modify default user permissions. Click on Go to Microsoft Entra ID. Click on Users and select User Settings. Setting Register Applications option to know prevent users from creating application registration. You can then grant the ability back to specific individuals by adding them to an application developer role. By default, all users can create tenants in the Microsoft Entra ID and Entra Administration Portal and Manage Tenant. Anyone who creates a tenant becomes the global administrator of that tenant. Setting this option to Yes restricts creation of Microsoft Entra ID tenants to the global administrator or tenant creator roles. Setting this option to No allows non-admin users to create Microsoft Entra ID tenants. Best practice is set this option to Yes and then assign the tenant creator role to needed users. Setting Create Security Group option to No prevent users from creating security groups. Global administrators and user administrators can still create security groups. The Microsoft Entra ID administrative portal has sensitive data. All non-administrators should be prohibited from accessing any Microsoft Entra ID data in the administration portal to avoid exposure. Restrict access to the Azure AD Administration Portal, also known as Microsoft Entra ID Administration Portal, to administrators only. Setting the switch to Yes restricts non-administrators from browsing the Microsoft Entra ID Administration Portal, which is earlier known as Azure AD Administration Portal. Non-administrators who are owners of groups or applications are unable to use the portal to manage their own resources. You can also grant only a specific non-administrator users the ability to use the Microsoft Entra ID administration portal by assigning them a role like Global Reader. Don't use this option as a security measure. Instead, Create a conditional access policy that targets Microsoft Azure management that blocks non-administrators access to Microsoft Azure management. Using this option, you can allow or restrict users from connecting the work or school account with the LinkedIn account. You have to configure default user permissions as per your organization's requirement. Select Yes to save the changes. In this lab, you learn the steps to set up default user permissions in Microsoft Entra ID. That's all for this lab guide. Stay tuned for more videos like this. See you all in the next lab guide.